burning question of the day how to lose belly fat quickly the magical solution big calorie deficit that's it go on now no but seriously there's a big problem with this question that i'm gonna explain now let's say that this is the amount of calories that you need for the day to stay whatever you are right now now there are two ways that you can lose belly fat number one you can reduce the amount of calories coming in you can do intermittent fasting, maybe skipping breakfast, maybe abandoning a whole nutrition group like carbohydrates. The second way is creating a deficit through exercise. And why you would want to do that is because when you exercise, you're expanding more calories. And when you're expanding more calories, you increase the amount that your body needs for the day to sustain what it is. And if you don't eat more food than usual, guess what? You lose fat. But when you cut down just your calories without any exercise, your body does have some adaptation that may or may not be important to you your body naturally moves less you might get cold as your body doesn't want to heat itself you might have some recovery hindrances but anyway back to the burning question how do you lose belly fat quickly let's assume that this is losing four pounds of fat per month but a lot of you will say no i want faster let's say eight pounds a month that is eight pounds a month not enough okay how about 16 pounds a month and now the reason why how to lose belly fat fast is a horrible question is because the faster you create fat loss the more severe your calorie deficit needs to be and quite literally the worse your life is gonna be because you've gone from a decent life of weight training three times a week maybe getting 10,000 steps maybe skipping a meal a day to living on calories like you're in literal poverty and doing six hours of cardio a day it is just not sustainable when it comes to losing fat it has to be sustainable otherwise you're just gonna gain it all back and destroy your life and the world's gonna end you want a deficit amount just enough so that your quality of life doesn't get destroyed and the, realistically the only people willing to sustain deficits like this is people in physique competitions who died for 20 weeks to look like a skeleton in a fake tan on stage what you should have been asking is how do i create a sustainable calorie deficit combined reduction in food intake and increasing energy expenditure that I can realistically live with and make real sustainable progress.